The long challenge this week is to analyze every single thing that you put in your mouth and write down why. Your short challenge for this week is a little bit more, is a little different. Um, it's gonna be due within the next four days, in response to this video. I want for you to take a picture of yourself to show off your personality to your teammates and to other, your other subscribers. This week's long challenge is um, to leave a bite of food on your plate no matter what you're eating. The long challenge is a mindful challenge. Some of you are going to really cringe on this, and it, I even cringe myself, but it's really important. I want for you in this next week to try to find time when you eat your meals to sit down, don't eat standing up, and to not talk on your phone, don't have any TV on, don't have even music on. Well, some light music in the background is fine. I want you to choose, but this is a simple version, choose three things that make you happy, that make you smile, not make you happy, that make you smile, that literally make you smile. <laughs> and put it on a piece of paper if you want to just write it out, if it's your kids or whatever, put three, you know, put the three things down, put more if you'd like. I'm making a smile box. But for this week, it's about water intake. It's about getting what your body needs, and that's the right amount of water. I'm going to let you figure out how much water your body needs. There's different formulas out there. Some will say, you know, drink half your body weight in ounces, and that's probably what I will end up doing. But whatever it is that you decide that you wanna do, get your water in, and for this next week, work on that every day of getting all your water in. So this week's mind challenge is about finding something about yourself that's, um, that makes you distinct, I guess. Um, but first and foremost, here is your challenge, your long challenge for next week, which will be finding other ways to incorporate exer exercise into your daily routine. So this is on top of what you've already got going. So I want you to in the next four days, you know, put your video up and include a picture or some type of symbolism of something that makes you want to work out, that makes you want to exercise. The challenge goes on, right? And we are at the halfway mark. We have six weeks left. Your short challenge for this week is all about revisiting your goals and revamping them if necessary. I think that um, you need to ask yourself when you're making goal when you're making your decisions um, is this bringing you closer to your goal or is this making you further away anyway we are on week eight and my challenge for you guys is to make five more videos now with that said I want for your challenge for the rest of the challenge to be to replace negative thinking. If you have any negative thoughts in your head, I want you to replace it with three positives. And I want you to get in the habit of doing that regularly. Now I think it's time to stomp your feet. I want you to get loud. It's really about eating right. It's really about exercising. It's really about you. The only thing I do want to say this week is something that I found really helpful for myself, um, acceptance. And I know that we've talked about this briefly in the past, but I really want you all to get to a place where you accept where you are right now and move forward. I really want for your focus these next couple of weeks, obviously, to be pushing towards the end results. But I also want you to remember what it is that you need to do for after the challenge is over. So this is it. We are in the last nine days of Hot for Halloween. I hope you have your costumes ready. I hope that uh, you take this next week uh, to fully just, you know, like on Biggest Loser, when they have their last workout, make this week count. And I know, for those of you who have stuck, in, stuck to this, that you can make it count. I know this. 
Um, I just, I just want to say how proud of you I am, and even those who dropped out early or who have dropped out, you know, towards the end. I want you to know that you need to just keep trying. You will find something that works for you, and even if you don't succeed, keep trying, keep going. Um, I believe that you will find what you're looking for as long as you keep trying and you don't give up. Um, my only challenge for you guys this week is to make sure that in your video response um, that you include your t-shirt size because Project Class Reunion, she made a post on Facebook asking for it. We only got a few responses and I know there's more of you in it um, than, the, than what responded on Facebook. So in your videos, respond with your uh, t-shirt size and put it in under the subject line. Um, you know, in the information box under the video. So let us know what that is. And also go over to Facebook and make sure you post it there too, just so we have all of the information that we need. Um, I'm, I'm just so proud of you guys. I really, really am. And I want you to give it your all this week. And it's been great. It's been fun. And I have certainly taken something from this. And I hope that you have as well. I love you guys.